Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Infinite Fusion as luck. If you guys missed in the last episode, we went through the sewers with Erica to finish taking on Team Rocket here in Celadon City, and we ended the episode fighting Giovanni. A very intense episode. You guys should definitely check out if you missed it, so go check it out if you haven't. But in this episode, we are going to head back to Lavender Town to take on the tower now that we have the Sylph skill. So before we get started, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe as I poke po uh, post Pokemon content here every week through streams, videos, and shorts. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get started here. Um, probably shouldn't run yet. Uh, you guys could probably tell by the layout, but um, I, I figure out something to fuse with Zoro, and uh, it leads to the normal ghost type type combo, which is very good. Its only weakness is dark. Um, it resists plenty of stuff, including ghosts, so it's not even weak to ghost. It's only weak to dark. Uh, it's immune to normal and ghost. Um, it's it's a pretty awesome typing to have so that is what we're gonna work with here I leveled up Jesse right before it evolves into Persian and uh, I evolved Tone Edge to Dubblade there um, so They will be level 33 when we fuse now um, The one on the right that's still normal is cooler. However, its stats aren't as good from what I've seen and um, It doesn't have that type combo of normal ghost it has steel normal so um I wanted to go for this because uh, it's it's an actual or useful type combo that's now four times weak to fighting and you know not as interesting looking but I'm just hoping that changes when it evolves into Persian in a level. Um, we're obviously going to keep the name Zoro. I don't think Technician would really come in handy because I don't have any like smaller damaging moves. So we'll keep No Guard and uh I think we're gonna take the gentle nature. I think we're gonna take the gentle nature because I don't know. I feel like I don't want we want, we don't want to sacrifice our speed, and I feel like it's more important to be specially defensive than physically defensive. And Meow's move set isn't that great. We're just gonna keep dead blades. All right, let's see. Let's see what you. No, don't unfuse it. <laughs> let's let's see what your stats are looking like. Your special defense is really low. Okay, I feel like it was a good idea because like it's still not that great, but our defense did not. Our defense is our highest stat besides HP, so I think I think we're fine sacrificing the defense a little bit. The special defense definitely needed a boost, so I will take that. Um, but we're gonna we're gonna lead you obviously because uh, you're one level away from evolving. And uh, as soon as we find a Dusk Stone, you'll be able to evolve into your final form, so. Hopefully that happens soon enough. But for now, we're gonna head over to Lavender Town, like I said we would. And we're gonna, we're gonna see some ghost types. Now, um, I leveled everybody up to 34. I was gonna do 32, but I feel like, you know, how this game goes and everything, and, and how we can't, like, necessarily spread the HP amongst the whole team. That uh, I leveled uh, us up to 34 because Erica's ace is 35. I feel like it's it's helpful and as always in us likes we don't need to be on par with the, with the gym leader's ace. We we need to be around the level of the ace. We're not doing the extreme nose like here, so we're not being capped. I just need to make sure that I'm not gonna lose Pokemon. Which by the way, I went into the Pokemon Center here because I forgot to get Rattata back out. So we'll go ahead and take Rattata back onto the team. Which we literally just need as an HM buddy. Hopefully soon uh, we won't need an HM buddy and we can replace Raditza with an actual team member. So the team can finally be full. Doesn't matter really too much to me either way though. Give me that item. Elixir. Let's go Steers. Hopefully um... I was hoping to get like a fuse encounter so we're not just getting a ghastly here, but we're just getting a ghastly here, so I guess I guess that's how this is gonna work. Um oh yeah, we have quick balls. Always use them. Always use them. Go quick ball. We have five of them, so we have plenty. Heck yeah. Take that ghastly. That's five whole encounters we can save time with, so I won't complain. Um, we're going to name you Luigi, because, I mean, duh. All 
right. Now let's fight this old lady. Obviously, we're going to lead Dewblade because uh, we're trying to get it up to level 34. Sorry, Meow Blade. <laughs> that, I love that. <laughs> the green gas. Hello, Bulbasaur. Um, I mean, neither of these are going to be stabbed. This one's stabbed, but it doesn't do too much. I'm going to use Night Slash. Oh no, not Insomnia. Oh no, no, I can't fall asleep. How dare you? Goodbye, Bull Batley. <laughs> Alright. Shortly. Okay, so I'm gonna guess that all three starters with their fusions with Ghastly are gonna be on these teams. I'm just I'm just making a solid guess, you know. Payback? <laughs> what was Blood planning to do there? <laughs> Chartly. So, if Farfetch'd fused with it, would it be Fartly? I'm gonna fuse Farfetch'd with Ghastly one day. We'll be able to confirm whether or not that's true. Alright. Let's take you on. The person who obviously has a Squirtle and Ghastly fusion. Squirtly! Wow! <laughs> Look at the eyes! It's got a little cute... Uh, little. Big cute eyes. <laughs> Aqua Tail. That's not gonna do too much. Goodbye, Squirtly. I love you for your existence, but... Your existence has to halt. That one was my favorite one, which is ironic because Squirtle's my least favorite Kanto starter. Which is not saying much because I love it. I love all three of the Kanto starters equally. Cubone's in here. Could have caught a Cubone. But it would have just been another ground type. We got plenty of those. <sighs> we don't have any ghost types except for Hone Edge, and uh, obviously that one, that one's on the team. But all right, let's see what you're all about. You probably got a Pikachu Gaslight Fusion. No, you got Gasicate. Level 34. Okay, maybe it was a good decision for me to level up to 34. Maybe I was thinking with my big brain. Let's switch out to our Dark type. It's probably going to use, like, Hyper Fang or something. Okay, no, I use Sucker Punch. We're going to use Assurance. Okay, we're slower. Cool. Get destroyed. <laughs> we just got one-shotted. Freaking annihilated. Alright, next up... Okay, I got confused there for a second on how I'm supposed to move through here. Just keep giving me encounters, I don't mind. There's gotta be at least- I feel like there's at least one wild fusion in every area. So there's gotta be something that's fused with Ghastly that I could've caught. Or even with the low chance of Haunter, like... I feel like if I came across a Haunter fusion, that would be like super rare. Ghastly, just a plain old Ghastly. It's, that should be easy enough. I mean, it's gonna sucker punch us, but that's not gonna hurt too much. Goodbye. Level 34 yet? Not quite. Gas, bruh. <laughs> I mean, uh, okay. Um, you gotta be Ghost Psychic, right? You're four times weak to dark. The only issue is here is that it uses a ghost type move after it. No, it can't use a ghost type move because I'm ghost normal. Ha, <laughs> take this. Oh god. Well, that's not going to do much. Four times super effective. You're dead. Goodbye. Goodbye, gas bra. <laughs> All right, here we go. Purblade. Purblade time. Heck yeah. Let's see what Purblade looks like. I mean, it looks like the same double blade build without the paw on the ribbon. I mean, it's still Persian's face just slapped in the middle. Swift. Yeah, we don't need Swift. We gotta retaliate for that. For normal type attacks. 
Okay, I'm gonna use a super potion. Zoro's level 34 and evolved into Purblade. Um, I'm gonna leave Emperor now, because, you know, we don't have to evolve that anymore, and I would like to use my Pokemon that can most likely annihilate any Pokemon in this tower without worry about getting harmed, so. Yes! I... I know I say this a lot when I see a fuchsia, but I like that. <laughs> I really like this one. This one's based on the, you know, before you get the self scope uh, sprite. So I like that. I like that a lot. I think that's really cool. The shadow ball is gonna tickle, and we're gonna we're gonna hit it with the assurance. We call that Emperor Family Insurance. All right, upstairs. Oh, there's an item. I don't like how the floor switch. There's no like fades, so they just keep teleporting you up and down the stairs. Ah! It's Huntley, it's Hunter and Ghastly. <laughs> so I found both of them fused with something else. That's intriguing. Not a useful fusion, but intriguing. All right, you're up next. I I have just a hunch that we're gonna be uh perfectly leveled for Erica, like at least 35 for everybody. But well, that's just a hunch. You're gonna be ghost flying, so I'm gonna use assurance. Oh no, I can no longer escape. What am I gonna do? Kill you? <laughs> Bite. Oh no, not swift. How dare you? Goodbye. You suck. <laughs> Goodbye, Karina. I mean, I'm sure the healing spot is soon, but I don't want to risk anything. Yeah, that's the healing spot right there, but there's at least one more person we have to fight. I'm not saying this toddler is going to be threatening, but you never know. <laughs> I mean, look at that. Look at that. Gas cute? Okay. Oh, God. I'd make that face, too. Holy crap. What, what the heck? Bye. I'll put you out of your misery. I'm sorry you exist. Good God. HP up. Sick. Well, I didn't need to use that super potion, but all's all that all's well that ends well. Like me running away from this ghastly. See, that's the only thing that annoys me about having intimidate is that if I run into wild Pokemon with Empress, it's gonna use it every time, but. First world problems, am I right? Alright, Honbat. I like this one. I like this one. I like how the, the mouth looks. It kind of reminds me, like, without the wings, it reminds me of that, um, uh, Polter Dash or Boulder, Pol whatever the Boulder Ghost Monster from Super Mario Galaxy is called. Whoa there, Buster, don't poison me. Okay, well, we're right by the healing spot, so we just have to defeat this thing. Take this bite. After you bite me, too. This was your only Pokemon, right? I only have to worry about this one. Level 35 for Emperor. Sick. Alright. Well, we're still gonna lead Emperor. If I need a grind off screen, I will, but I don't really need to, considering that... Everybody's level below Erica's Ace, except for Empress. Get out of here. Get out of here, Ghastly. Get the heck out of here. Heal me up. Heck yeah. Now we have to fight this lady. I don't want to give you my soul. Why would I give you my soul? That's disgusting. Drowder. Freaking psychic ghost again. I don't like how this one looks. It's, it's small eyes scare me. I don't like that. Goodbye. Finding all these ghost psychic types. I'm pretty sure that Execute Fusion was ghost and not, I mean, psychic and not grass too. I just want to get this TM. That's the only reason I went over this way. I could have avoided her, but I didn't really feel like trying. Lefgar. Oh, Clefable got its shadow back. <laughs> it's not going to be part, no, it's definitely going to be part fairy. Let's just see how much assurance does. Yeah, that did not do too much. Um, ghost resists poison. 
So poison would also be neutral. The only thing I can really do here is use a ghost type move and uh, you just have shadow sneak. And I'm not going to risk it just for you to get hit by a dark type move by Clefgar here. So I'm just going to do how much, uh, see how much Aqua Tail does because, you know, we don't have to use super effective moves. Yeah, you're going. Bye. <laughs> take that, Jennifer. As I take this. Willow Wisp. That was pointless. <laughs> uh, and here I am running into another Pokemon. Hi, Haunter. So we saw Haunter and a fusion with Haunter. They either up the chances or it's not really that rare as I thought. This is the last floor because that staircase leads up to Team Rocket and you take on the Marowak. Whoa! <laughs> Three different Haunter sprites making up Hauntrio. Nice. All right, we're, gonna, you're, we're obviously going to use Assurance here. Even, we even get outsped, so yeah, you're, you're doomed to die. Level 36 almost. All right, Marowak, let's see what you're all about. Is it even a Marowak in this game? That's just a regular mom. That's just a regular mom. I mean, she's got... Whoa. It's Gengar... 40? Now let's do this nice and carefully, okay? You're going to get hit by an assurance? It's not going to do half. I'm going to guess that you're part ground. So I'm going to use the super potion. Mmm, yummy. And you're going to use thrash, which is going to tickle. Um, but then I'm going to use, I'm going to use aqua tail. And it's going to hit. It's going to hit and it's going to hit nice. Yeah. And you're dead. You're just dead. You're just absolutely gone, dude. Dragon rage. That's not going to do that good for us at this point in the game. Why would you learn it that late? 40 HP guaranteed is not going to do us that much this far in the game. Everything's going to have at least 40 HP. Even a random Weedle would. Alright. Oh, I'm going to have to buy more super potions after we leave, but... I'd rather do that than head back to the healing circle. All right. Oh, no Team Rocket, just Mr. Fuji? These Team Rocket Grunts came... These Team Rocket Grunts came looking for a prototype of the Master Ball. I'm afraid I was no match for them. They took what they were looking for. I'm truly worried about what such an evil organization could do with such a powerful tool. Using innocent Pokemon for monetary gain, it fills my heart with sadness. Letting your Pokedex quest may uh, fail without your love for Pokemon. I think this may help your quest. Now we can wake up the Snorlax. Upon hearing the Poke Flute, sleeping Pokemon will spring. Guys, you know what I just realized? We could fuse Snorlax with Dubblade, and that might be way better than Persian. Oh. <laughs> Shut up, Mr. Fuji. I'm going to sell it on. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> do I have an escape rope? Do I have an escape rope? I don't think I do. Yeah, I do. Okay, let me use it. Heck yeah. All right, guys, let's go to Celadon and get ourselves a Snorlax. I'm going to go ahead and put Meowth in the PC. Or Persian in the PC. I mean, at least you didn't die before it happened, because then I wouldn't be able to keep the Dewblade at all since it already died through Vulpix. But, dude, why did I not think of that in the first place? I was like, well, there's probably a better normal type, but I don't think I'll get one anytime soon. I'm literally going to get Snorlax in this episode, so let's, uh, let's, uh, unfuse these bad boys. It's right there, let me do. We're still getting the same type combo, and it's going to be an even better Pokemon. This thing's defense is going to be wild once it becomes a Snorlax, so, uh, let's go ahead and, uh, I have Fly now, by the way. I don't think I ever... I, I don't think I pointed it out in the last episode. If it even happened in the last episode. Um, but I ended up getting a Fly off screen. So, uh... 
we can fly places now if I need to. I even forgot that myself. I was like, can I fly now? I'm like, yeah, I can. Yeah, we don't have any flying types on our team, so I have to I have to pull pull Merkur out, but I could have fl fl uh, flew to Lavender, Lavender Town at the beginning of the episode instead of walking, but it's okay, it's not the end of the world. Uh, Celadon's over here, so. Away we fly, my friends, away we fly. Hopefully this, I'm pretty sure the Snorlax is like level 30, isn't it? So the level drop shouldn't be like too large when they fuse. So let's go ahead and uh, catch the Snorlax. Do, 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 do. Hopefully a quick ball works. Do, 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 do. Hello, Snorlax. I would love to play the Pokey Flute. I would love nothing more. I can't hear the sound, so I don't even know if it's playing anything. Probably was there. All right. Snorlax. Hello. It's level 30 like I thought. Okay, cool. All right, Snorlax. Let's make this nice and easy. You're going to get in this quick ball, and it's going to be awesome. So every day you get a chance to catch Snorlax in a quick ball and it broke out immediately, so, <laughs> you know. Um, this thing's gonna be bulky though, so I'm gonna use Assurance. Or even slower, so it doesn't even do double. It's got leftovers too. That's sick. Okay. That's gonna heal it back to yellow. Uh, we don't have Ultra Balls still. We only had one and we used it on a freaking muck. Come on, Snorlax. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's freaking go. All right. I'm going to name you Sasha after Sasha from Attack on Titan. Because of how hungry you are. And uh, let's go ahead and fuse you two together. 34. Perfect. On par. That steel normal one, again, looks cool, but we want the normal ghost fusion, so. We're gonna take this path. Let's get it. Snorlax, fused with the blade. Now that, that is cooler. That actually incorporates Snorlax instead of slapping its face on. Not saying that, and the blades are Z's. What is this, World World? Weird World? Shout out if you guys remember that show. What? No nickname? Oh, I didn't have a nickname. We'll have to nickname it Zoro again, but, um. Ensures moves land or prevents poison. I think I'm gonna go with no guard. Plus, we don't want to lose defense either way, but I don't want to lose special attack, so we'll get rid of we'll we'll, we'll get rid of physical defense with gentle. Or, uh, no, that would add special attack. What am I thinking? Uh, we'll take gentle. We'll take gentle. Combine move sets. Yawn. You you probably just don't have anything too crazy then, actually. What happened to my ghost type move? Or my dark type? Well, I don't need a dark type move because I got a dark type, but I don't even have shadow sneak anymore. I'll figure out move sets off screen. We don't need you to learn yawn. Body slam is useful though. Body slam is useful. I'm gonna get rid of retaliate. Rest. Uh. And it's got snore too, yeah. Wait, how, how much does snore do? Uh, it's only 50. If it was like 70, I'd feel stupid, but... Yeah, we'll take it. We'll take it. All right, guys. Well, I'm obviously going to end off the episode with that, which is uh, pretty good. Uh, if you guys feel like there's something I should have done instead of Snorlax, or if you feel like, you know... Don't, didn't I get Shadow Ball or something recently? 
Like, give me something ghost type. Okay, I'll, fi I'll figure it out off screen. I'll figure out when, when we'll be able to get another ghost type move off screen. Because hopefully Shadow Ball or something good ghost type happens soon. Because uh, even if we had Shadow Seek, it's not the best ghost type move. I want something better. Um, but uh, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Infinite Fusion. In the next episode, we will definitely be starting at Erica's Gym. So look forward to that. But that's going to do it for me. So this is Inferno Burning, and we'll catch you guys in the next episode. Adios.